All right, we're here at Buttonwillow Raceway, and this is Ron's M3. It's an E90 M3, manual transmission. Very nice, you can see that he has partially gutted the car. In the back, we got a fire extinguisher, a roll bar, GoPro, Recaro seats, some harnesses. It's all set up. He has a uh, PFC big brake kit in here, front and rear. These are forged Volk wheels, uh, Hankook TD, and then JRZ RS Pros. And then a wing back here too. And then this is a C7 Z51 magnetic shocks uh, competition seats. And I put some NT01s on here, stock brake pads in the back, and then I put some old Carbotech pads up front. I think they're uh, XP12s. So up on the front left there, you can see there's an Audi race car. It looks like a factory team or something. There's a, there's a, a couple of them. Mustang is revving its engine. There's a uh, brand new Grand Sport right behind me. So we'll see how that does. See how my car does. I got my tire pressure up because I want to see what these NT01s do as far as pressure as they get warmed up. Standing yellow on the outlap. You can see that on the right there. Howard is warming up his tires. Howard is in the uh, red S2000. Oh my God, this is fantastic. I have the stock suspension right now. Just stiffened up the mag ride by putting it into track mode. So much grip, not even warmed up. This is gonna be nuts. All right. Nicely weighted steering wheel on this uh, Corvette. Really unbelievable how good this Corvette feels already compared to the other Corvettes I've owned. This thing just wants to frickin' rip. Feels like a race car, it's unbelievable. This is a heavy car and it just wants to rip. I'm gonna follow hard for a little bit here and then we're probably gonna go past him because this car is a little bit faster than an S2000. Following Howard in here, Howard and Ron. Yeah, there's just so much grip here, I don't know what to do with it. Woohoo, Jesus!
Oh, this is not good. All right, here we go. We're gonna come in. Let's see if we can drag race power down the straight. Woo, baby! Lots of braking grip with this mother f I don't wanna say any bad words, there could be kids watching. thing is a rocket. Unbelievable grip through these corners. Feels like I'm cheating. I can't catch Ron. Or maybe I can. I just don't know yet. This car is so fast. It's unbelievable. I'm having trouble keeping up with this car. It's like a insane, just insane experience. I can't even put this into words how good this car is. It's just unbelievable. Got a little oversteer there, but nicely balanced overall. Uh, chasing Ron. Ron's going off the track. These are fun tires. I can tell you that much. So my hot pressures are up. Uh, 33 in the front, 34 in the rear. I started 28 all around. And we are getting some slip angle with these. The car is stepping out. Ron's really carrying some speed through there. I can probably carry more speed through this, honestly. I'm not even slipping. Uh, we're stuck behind the uh, Scion. Probably not the ideal car to bring to this group. Just losing that guy. We're hanging with Ron though. And that's what's important. Looks like we got a lot of traffic up in here. This is the fastest run group and I had to uh, go through a bunch of stuff to sign up for it. And the only reason I came out to this run org is because all my friends were coming out. I'm not a huge fan of this run organization. Last time we went out there was way too much traffic when we were shooting the Lotus video. And if I can't get clean laps, then it just kind of is a waste of money. But this is pretty fun. This is a nice pace, this group here. 
especially if you have a high horsepower car like us.